What up, folks? What yes, up, sir? What up? what up, what up? I just see podcast, man. Episode 79. Ooh, 79. Yes, we getting sir. through them, man. We getting through them. Yes, we are, man. Yes, we yeah. are. Almost on the uh, 100. Yeah. Yeah, we on the way to 100. Yes, sir. We should turn up for the 100. Have some, you know, daiquiris in here or something. You <laughs> some know what I'm saying? Daiquiris. Only always right. the daiquiris. That's always the daiquiris. Oh, we up right now. <laughs> huh? Goddamn. As soon as the podcast start, man, just buzz, buzz all on my phone. Like, y'all just picked the perfect time. Oh, yeah. Of course. Daiquiri. Yeah. Daiquiri. So, uh, we want to dedicate episode 79 to the fellas uh last week Yo. if you tuned into the episode 78 we we said we had to have a conversation with us you know what i'm saying like talk. it was something that we needed to have a conversation about man because of how it's been going out here in these streets man how dudes been acting how they be you know simping and um doing the most doing actually. the most you know Rapist. not really not really living up to the term of being a real man and uh it's crazy because i wasn't even trying to find this particular topic relating to what we're about to talk about but it just so happened uh, i guess recently this guy uh, black guy uh <clears throat> was in the news for <clears throat> shooting uh the person he was dating he shot her dog and killed her now the reason why he shot the person's dog is because they didn't oh get God, to go on a bro. date so they didn't go on a date and in his response was to shoot that person's dog and kill their dog and now he's in jail and I think he thought he wasn't going to get any consequences behind shooting a Because dog. it was a dog. Because people, for some reason, think because you shoot a dog, everything is okay. I don't know if they understand the rights of animals. Clearly, they haven't well, paid attention just, to anything. Exactly. Just yeah. in general, they have pulling a little out bit more a rights weapon almost than we do. because it didn't go right for you. <laughs> fellas, fellas, oh, fellas. Sure. We need to need to be able to understand come on, that come rejection on, come on. Come at us, man. is come on. a real thing and it's a part of life. <laughs> this is why certain women don't feel comfortable around us, especially in certain situations when it comes to like getting to know somebody. Yeah. Because of situations like this. Boys be down bad. Like what what, what makes sense? I right, we ain't get to go on a date. Maybe you can reschedule. Or maybe if the person not into you. Talk to somebody else. Keep it moving. But my first mind is not to just chill. Let's see if I can find a you know a, a better situation or maybe replan it. I'm gonna shoot your dog, and that way you are gonna understand how hurt I am. Savage. That makes no kind of sense, guys. I don't know who told y'all, or maybe it's the trend that people like that toxic stuff that's not cool that's not cool we need to get rid no. of that notion of being toxic is cool yes i got the hat i, I swear i'll you read my mind that. Yeah, yeah. I was, I did, <laughs> looking like a real advocate over here right? drugs are bad but, <laughs> but yeah, excuse man, don't the smoke wardrobe me. i'm supporting the homie excuse the don't wardrobe coke, okay? flip it back right <laughs> flip it backwards man just flip he's at right. right. i'll flip it back this is snapback day today anywho the point i'm trying to make here is <laughs> this this is not how you like I, move forward as a man. Me personally, I ain't gonna lie, Ross. That was the wrong hat to wear today. No, I, <laughs> Why are you using? The I word wasn't, toxic? You, bro. Because you, you know, hold on, bro. I want you to cook. You were bro, talking about man. it, and I'm like, I haven't noticed that you. It's you always like, wearing hey, a toxic man. merch, but I'm like, I don't yeah, think I support, he's wearing it today. I but I turn my head, I'm like, you wearing a damn hat. I, I get it, bro. Man. Like, I mean, I well, okay, yeah, right. This a yeah. He support the homie. Yeah, of course, of course. That's a that's a toxic venom. That's what it is. It's just funny that. Yeah, I know. The relation of what I'm talking about and not being toxic and having on a toxic yeah, I get it, I get it. Cook, but the point yeah. I'm trying to make here as men we gotta be able to be uh I guess accept rejection or disappointment because it's life exactly. there's plenty of women out there there's plenty of situations where you can just you know maybe even recover it maybe you can't get that next date but now you're not about to get shit if you shoot they dog or even try to harm them like where, when did that become cool? What I never understand is, is, is so many other women out there. It's like it's crazy. somebody eventually. I mean, bro, we did whole reactions watching mm -hmm. people who believe they're, they're squirrels and animals yeah. find love. They, these How? are people yeah, that yeah. think they're coyotes and wolves yes. meet other wolf humans. Yes. Yes. Married right now. That's a real thing. Yeah. Right. So you telling me you think it's impossible for you to find the person so that way you can uh, take your time, even though you take some rejection. It's, but you know what it is? It's rejection. People don't know how to really face not no. People can't handle People don't can't handle oh, no. You got to keep it moving, my boy. And, and, like, and I, so that's what I fear with what we're doing with the kids nowadays. Like They want to raise these kids on straight emotions. I say it all the time on the pod. 
you know, but we have to kind of give them a little piece of reality sometimes, yeah. you know, like, oh, yeah, look, everything ain't going to work. Yeah. Like, you know, you can't always get everything that you want. And that way, you know, whenever, you know, you get in real life, in the real world, and you start getting them nose, you're not ready to bring a, you know, a weapon to your job and just end it yeah. to fail about it. You're not, you're going to already be well equipped with understanding, like, okay, sometimes I get what I want, sometimes I don't, but mm -hmm. I got to continue to work hard because, you know what, everything doesn't always fall in my lap when I want it to. Facts, but right. the fact yeah. that now, nah, dudes, it's getting so sad because, like you're saying, women, you know, and then you do have those women that, that do press the line, of which course. I feel like, you know, it's kind of dangerous because yep. I always say a lot of men now are on a different type of time. So when I see a woman that be like, I wish a nigga would, I'm like, nah. well, and to the ladies, if you nigga, already, nah, would. Yeah, if you already know you dealing with a man that possibly have issues like that, do not, do not trigger that man. Oh, like he that. crazy. What's that? What's that girl that said I want a dude to pull his gun out on me? Uh, Ari. What's, it's like, come on, See, bro. Yeah, what, what are we doing here? And niggas and, is actually pulling the gun out. Yeah, mm -hmm. and shooting your animal, or or, or you, in, or you, or in the situation, yep. I think I did a little reel to where the dude went to his ex house. And poured lighter flu on her door and tried to set it on fire. Yep. I'm about to try to kill her. And it's like, exactly. and obviously she had the ring camera, which was good. So she had proof or whatnot. And, you know, it's it's one of those things where it's like, there's a thing, there's a process. Like, we, I think all guys have dealt with that one person or someone that they really had true feelings for and it didn't work out. Yeah. And the heartbreak was tough. But your first instinct should not be going to that person's crib unannounced real, and man. trying to set their crib oh, on fire. Or to kick their door down. Or, or do similar things. Exactly. Ignorant shit. Like. Because <laughs> all that does is prove the point of why y'all shouldn't even be together. Even if that's not the reason y'all broke up, you just, just proved the point. You just reminded her. You know? And <laughs> it's, I don't know why guys just be thinking, oh, I'm a guy and she a woman, so I'm going to just go ahead and do this and you know, it, it is what it is, you know, because I'm in this emotional state. Like, until you get locked up with them real men. Yeah. And, and now you really, yeah. Man, not a rose change. Crazy. Yeah. Man, you see that it's on a daily basis, somebody getting locked up over some stupid shit, domestic situation. Now you over there. And yet right? these fellas are still, they risking it. Yeah, bro. So, like, no, nah, I'm, 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 I'm a rider for mine. Like, nah. No, bro. It's, like, come on, guys. Come on, fellas. Like, you see, got it, bro. you yeah. see the, the BS. You see other people doing dumb stuff getting in trouble for it getting locked up for it so you do the same damn some thing some people honestly don't care until they there i mean that's a sad part really too the slogan that's right, right there yep. don't care don't until care until they, they there true yeah. true i mean you that's, can't care that's how people move bro people yeah. move like they just don't give a damn and yeah. then it's then like they find bro out the hard way that's just life for a lot of dummies yeah and and, and some, it's what about to say go ahead <laughs> no, no, what was about to say? <laughs> yeah, <both> <laughs> no, 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 you right, you right. <laughs> but nah, man, it's it's like I don't I don't know, bro. I don't and it, the person that got arrested, he was an older guy. He was older than all of us, bro. So it's like it's not even relegated to young men. It's old men doing some wild shit and expecting it's just dumb men, bro. <laughs> it's that too. Dumb Very man, dumb men, bro. Bro. It's just like you just, It don't matter how old you are. At, at all. It, you would think, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Someone being like in their 40s, 50s would know how to kind of move as a man. You want to chill, bro. That, but Around still, your mid 30s, you just want to chill. 60, 70 like, year old I'm gang trying to relax. at this point. So. Oh, that's why. Like, what are you doing? Like, I'm like, like bro, like, sit down. It's okay. And they for real. Are you, feel, feel, are you <laughs> feeding the community? <laughs> you got to relax. You're doing bro. the same <laughs> shit you were doing 30 block, plus years ago. Like, you about 81. I'd be trying to get my life right with God, making sure I'm straight. Exactly. You all, yeah. Come on, man. God be like, hold on, partner. You you, you about to meet me. You two coughs from a goddamn nurse. Exactly. You out here trying to thug it. What yeah. block? You about a, a block of wood and shit for a coffin and shit? <laughs> yeah, about? A block like, artery, nigga. You yeah, better like, understand how to... <laughs> like, not, nah, but it is... But that's the thing with the whole notion of uh, just because you older, I mean, you mature and you are uh, you know, a responsible person. No. Sure. You know, you got old dogs, old fools. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Old fools who still run the same game. Hell, I remember working at the store, H-E-B, and there used to be some old men Crazy, come in the store and mm -hmm. they get their little shopping cart, the little basket, the little handheld basket. <laughs> they walk around, you see them, and then I remember one time asking the dude if he needed some help. He like, nah, man. To be honest with you, I ain't really in here to buy nothing. I just, just came here around. to look around. We already what type of life is that? What kind of shit is this? You like, ain't even oh, at no club. You at a damn grocery store. Yeah, I mean, well, he was, you know, it was some eyes in there. But, uh, but I mean, definitely, but yeah, like, I know, on, I know the location. Sixty yeah. something but years old. Like, like, yeah, life ain't that. It ain't that serious. It's not, bro. 
at all. I, I get off of work. I'm going home. I ain't mm-hmm. finna be going to no store just to look around. That's yeah. what? That's you gotta have time. a lot of time on your hands. I mean, a lot of them old dudes do. It's true. <laughs> true. But them be the ones sugar pops. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. And we gotta since we in that oh boy we sugar pops boy y'all are re- messing the game up for the young ones boy, boy, I, boy. Swear, I never I thought that was urban I'm, legend I'm so glad I'm not in the game like, like, yeah, I'm just, glad man. I'm not in the game no more but boy they making it hard for y'all man like I boy feel bad I I because females automatically uh, because uh, if you ain't doing it uh Elroy mm-hmm. and he all he's gonna do is just want to hear, hear me talk to him on the phone the Otis yeah, just want me to talk to him. Yeah, my old lady gave me trouble, man. Yeah, I was going, you know, <laughs> and it's it's crazy, bro, because it's like One of them I names. can't even come at a woman sideways for <laughs> doing that because it's like it, it's like guys a, are doing it, it's so like it's like unlicensed you, psychiatrists. But damn, you can, dude. yo, that's exactly what it's unlicensed like. psychiatrists. Like, damn, that's what it is. And then <laughs> some of them are doing a little bit extra for some extra of change. Yeah, that's just all. Yeah, y'all, y'all nasty. So, like, but uh, it's like oh, yeah. that's the that's the way. Don't now. talk about the standards on y'all Instagram stories. And then you got man Otis man mm-hmm. that's busting it down scary, for you. Though that's like yeah, it's just, especially it for down. single guys exactly. right now because. It's it's so many guys like yeah I I drink your bath water no, I will do this well, you know, I pay, all you gotta do is oh uh, here you know. here's, go ahead here's the one I've been seeing or I have seen uh, hey fellas stop hitting up with the you know saying you look beautiful in the DMs send her twelve hundred dollars and say you know take her on vacation Bruh. I don't even know you <laughs> fellas don't do that. So let me get this straight. I really got no comment. Man. Somebody said, "I'm not making this up." Oh, I'm that not, same I'm dude. I'm just trying to make sure he goes viral at the same shit like that. Yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. He got like face tattoos or some mm-hmm. shit. Yeah, I yep, know what I'm talking yep, about. Yep, yeah, that's yep, yep. yeah, you an idiot. It's a dude on Instagram. Mm-hmm. He went viral. He's always he makes compilation videos of just saying this is what you need to do for uh for your woman. and of course the women for, women just girls in general. I just want to get that, that get that yeah. together. So he wants you not necessarily knowing this lady. Yeah. Because but, she's beautiful to you. Right, but you just want to go ahead and pay. No. He wants you to send her $1200. That's the way to stand out. To a, to a random place. chick. Yes. Yes. Send Where, her on vacation. Part, Instead of going in the DM saying the typical stuff. Sure, you got it. Yeah, so hey, take her on a trip. Take her on a nice expensive date. Somebody you don't know. Yes, not making this Absolutely. Up. Streets is done. And done. then once she asks, "Hey, I'm can on I a sidewalk." Do it again. Streets is done. <laughs> Bro, that shit's crazy. And then all you see in the comments, obviously the women. Yes, this is yes, this is that mm-hmm. energy yes. that I need. Truth, yes, truth this is why I feel like it's it easier to date now than before. Why is that? Because you can catch all that. Oh yeah, you can. Spot on, dead giveaway. You can. You a give. You a giveaway. True. If you're subscribing to that, that notion of like yes. Yeah, you can I automatically just, put you. You go ahead and X them out right mm-hmm. now, bro. Oh, immediately, mm-hmm. yeah. it makes the if you're makes looking the, the screening process ex- easier. Man, it's the like process mm-hmm. is definitely easier. Yeah, mm-hmm. you, you can just. Statuses, they so they you learn a lot on Instagram stories. Oh, they tell this your is life what on a real man does. Yep. And Friends then list, it, and then they're yep. like co-signing it and shit. Yep. Like, oh, okay, cool. Okay, just think when we was in high school or when I yeah when I. last year like you know going into college or whatever probably in college when we used to talk to certain chicks. We always used to do the homie check. Oh, do you know? <laughs> yeah. Do you know? I know you go to you go to such and such. Do you know this somebody name? Because I know the homies that be you know moving. Mm-hmm. And yep. if if I ask the homie, hey, you know uh, Tanya? <laughs> That's it. I know what that yeah. means. You are like, right, oh, next. Sorry. You hit a laugh, bro. Right. I ain't do nothing, but Tanya. I know my homie. Right. <laughs> oh, yeah. Tanya. No. When he Q- laughed like that. Q J. Let me throw DJ. The other day that was on Tanya Choo 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 Choo. Tanya, Tanya. Come on, ride that train. I, I, I. That's enough. Right. Go ahead and get it that way. So we had to do it that way, but now it's like you can just log in on this computer on your hand. And you could just be like, hmm, she friends with someone. So, yeah. oh, okay, I see she go out a lot. Oh, okay, I see. Oh, she got a close friends. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. You know, the close you know, friends. And it's like, it's, or if they add you to it because yeah. they think that's being cute. But I see, to me, you just kind of putting a, 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 a PG only fans together. On that's very close true. friends. That's, like, that that's don't mean you want to talk to me, yeah, which yeah. they probably do in Smash. But at the same time, it's just showing me that you kind of for the streets. Yeah. Yep. You put a you for the private streets, which is for the because yeah. you don't know who else is in there. No, no, yeah, no. yeah, yeah. It's it it's like yeah. low key, just like you said. 
private. Right. Yeah, it's private. It's not. <laughs> oh, not I'm the, in the close friends. Yeah, you in the close friends, but yeah, there's, but you don't, there's other you don't know people who else. that are in that close friends. So you just, seeing something and you like, ooh, and you know you thinking like with your yeah. other head, and you like, okay, let me go ahead and. Well, it's another dude. Oh, yeah. yeah, damn. You know way. what I'm saying? I'm, I'm in your close. I'm, but the only, only difference, three of them. she got two of them that's uh, doing twelve hundred dollars in the vacation. That's what I'm about to say. Then she got the that's the only one differentiating. That's the only that's differentiating factor. Right. He's spending twelve. Is. You just like that damn. Shit is Ross viewed. <laughs> that's sick. Just bro, going over. So that's why I say it's kind of. It's to me. It's just like you can just weed out the bad apples. Simple as that, bro. bro. I'm I'm pretty like, easy. You got the vacation dude. You got the one that's just getting the views. That's not getting the message real mm-hmm, red. Or mm-hmm. it just might be red, and that's it. And then you got the other dude that's just smashing. And then yeah, that's that's pretty much the process. Got yeah. like mm-hmm. a total of three, four, five. You know, because side niggas is the is the wave. Oh no! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> According to and then new life. since we bring it up, right yeah, away. <laughs> they got one for each, each other category. The, the like, side guys makes man, no sense. Hey fellas, man, you gotta be aware when your chick is for the streets and understand like what Dub was saying. The signs, the signs show you if you sitting up here trying to present her as a queen or treat her like a queen, but you know. How she moves, you know the friend groups that she's in move kind of funny, man. You gotta pay attention to that because mm. you're gonna go outside. Because guess what, the side niggas are already there. Mm. They yeah. they already just you know doing their mm. thing, moving, What's up, and moving. They they living off of your dime. You yeah. giving her extra money or whatever, and they back though having a good time on your dime. Absolutely. You feel me? And that's a real thing. It happens all the it time. It happens I'll... a lot more than you want to admit. So, fellas, you got to pay attention to, like Dub was saying, the signs are there. Like, women are very crafty at keeping certain secrets and oh, yeah. being sneaky. Oh, they sure. are very good at that's that. That's their skill set. But one thing <laughs> for smart sure, cookies a too. lot of women are very telling on their social media more than you realize. It may be something subtle. It yep. may be uh, like they may repost a meme. That applies to them because most people do that. They post memes or little like them little quotes that no, people be anything. Mm-hmm. Justin LaBoy is like out the window. Yeah, like, you know they post on. stuff like, <laughs> like that that applies to them, so <laughs> yep. you can kind of tell. And plus, once again, you can tell who someone's hanging out with. Yeah. So like, come on, like you gotta you gotta read between the lines, man. Don't be giving this girl. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, let me. I just dropped. Fifty thousand on her, you know what I'm saying? I show my queen love, boom, 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 and she out here getting piped unless with the fifty thousand. Like, it's table. just <laughs> unless he doing that because he know he got a side piece, and that yeah, too that, that can be a good yeah, yep. yeah, the cycle. But why? Like it's just like damn, for no reason. Be single, why right? y'all? Yeah, just you'll be single. Labels no longer mean a goddamn thing. Oh, damn, fifty thousand, fifty thousand. Is that not what we say about the whole exclusive thing? That shit is so stupid. Mm-hmm. This is, just this a is lot true. of confusion. That's all it is, and then emotions get mixed, and then you got guys going to doors pouring gasoline on the fucking door. There you see. <laughs> get my fifty thousand back. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't give a fifty thousand, I'm gonna blow this bitch up right now. I swear for God. Like <laughs> I, I thought I was main dude, not side dude. See, and that's where you messed up, yeah. my boy. Like there it is, bro. I thought I was main. Come on, dude, that's all that. Like, let me find out. That's the reason why he want to do something catastrophic like that. What was what, what was the cause of that? What did that man do? Bruh. To where he just felt betrayed. <laughs> like, he was betrayed beyond belief. You got to be betrayed, I mean, bro. like, bro, there's, there's nothing wrong, bro. Of course, treating your lady or that's, you know, significant yeah. you know, other man special, you know. But, you know, as long as you get the same energy back. Yeah. Like, bro, just going out, man, giving your money to, like, random females. Like, I don't get what is the premise oh, of that. I am like, no, bro, I just don't. I'm a firm believer of cutting off negative energy, bro. You right. just move on. Yeah, I'm just simple like, as that. The moment you feel that energy back, exactly. you get... Deuces or whatever you feel, even though y'all not in the actual. Bro, relationship, I'm constantly on following people on Facebook and Instagram. I'm like, look, I don't like your vibe, even though I ain't bro. seen you in about a couple years. Absolutely, like you know, you just I don't even watch you on my page no more, my social media. Absolutely, yeah. Some of the quotes is just like, bro, I understand, bro, it's speech, freedom of speech, or whatnot. That's your opinion, but some of it's like, but that's right. but that's fair because you know what. You have control over your social media. It's true. So mm-hmm. if you don't want to see something, what did you do? Simple as that. What did I you don't do? Follow them, yeah. You simply. I didn't debate nothing. I'm yeah, like, nah. It, it, it's yeah. no need. Why yeah. can't people just? Do, I can disagree with you. The Kevin Sam situation, regardless how you felt, the, a man died, bro. And people was calling him. Like at the end of the day, you gotta yep. really realize. Exactly. Women was calling this man. Y'all I saw so saying, much BS, bro. When he, he was passed derogative, away. he was this, he was that. Yep. But why were so many women still calling this man? Yep. You know what you could have did? Let his social media dry yep. up. 
up by go. not entertaining it. Because you knew there was a good chance you were going to be put on his YouTube channel and you were going to go viral with the yes. stuff you're saying. And he was like, oh, let me get on here and try to yep. go live with him and tell him something. Like, no, ignore it. Just just let something die out and just move mm-hmm. on. You yep. know, that's, that's literally how you let something, like, people just want to argue. People want to, you know, have confrontation. Yeah. And it's just mm-hmm. so much hatred. Like, people Like looking. the recent situation with the guy who brought food to his kid and then the baby mama. I saw that yesterday, yeah. Her own kid with some other baby daddies. And uh, he brought food to his kid that was with her. Mm-hmm. And he only brought food for him. Mm. And she was like, no, 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 no. And I was like, all right, cool. Um, I knew this was coming. I knew this was about to go all over social media because, you know, people have to debate about this. Mm-hmm. Was he wrong or obligated to bring food for them? I was like, technically, no. No, technically, He's not no. obligated. He only has one responsibility, kids. that kid. Yeah. Like, that's his kid. Yeah. But when I was, you know, looking at it, she did kind of respond kind of ignorantly or whatever. So I'm not really on her side as far as that goes. But as you look at it, though, you bringing food only to your kid with the other kids there. Yeah. That kind of puts your kids yeah. True, position. true. Definitely. Yeah, yeah. Does, for default. sure. And it's not even like a, not even on some, uh, uh, just because they didn't get to eat. It's almost in like a kid start looking at the other kid a little differently. Uh, you know, yeah. Time. And so, the only thing too about that is we don't know the context. So we exactly. don't, we don't know what happened before. Yeah, if they, no clue. Like if he gave he him was, some food before and mm-hmm. something, yeah. somebody hey, don't be giving my kid no food, nigga. You yeah, know, like you I never know. know. That too. To the video, I was just like, yeah. oh, okay, whatever. I, I can't, think, I can't go off of clips because yeah, it's like, same. bro, one clip does not tell me the story of y'all whole relationship. So, That's exactly how I look, felt. Bro, so when I was listening to, know. to it, like I, when I like. I didn't even listen to it. I just kept seeing the video mm-hmm. of them arguing or whatever. Yeah. And I just saw like, the quote. He had the title. I'm just, I, so he yeah. brought food to his kid. Oh, okay. Got you. Uh, all right. Well, I mean, depending on the context, I mean, I'm kind of 50 50 on the situation. Yeah. So. I don't really yeah. can't really say much, but, but you know what? I'm gonna keep on scrolling <laughs> you know, on my. Exactly. Just you know? don't <laughs> try your best now, to. That's the new debate. Should he have brought kid food for his kid? Should he have? Oh see, God, I don't even go to the comment section for, for stuff like that because I just know I'm about, I'm about to see some BS. <laughs> you were like, I wouldn't even go to the comment section because I'm pretty entertain. sure I'm going to see you some. You'll anger yourself. Yeah, yeah, my thing is, I mean, fellas, because then you'll see some ignorant comments yeah. in there. Bro. Try your best to not not pregnate a chick that already has kids by other dudes because that's yeah. just a situation no, if he was the you want to avoid. We don't know that. Yeah. Well, I mean, yeah, yeah true. So we just in general. Yeah. Just one but that's a that's a good rule to kind of yeah. live just by. Some you got to, yeah, you, you could possibly another do. Another tidbit with. for you guys. Like, yeah, yeah, if y'all watch well, our podcast. Say, uh, that's that's, that's kind of tough. Yeah, you know, that's that a tough is, one. It is tough. It's a tough place to be. Especially at age. It's a tough place to be in, man. Especially you break up, that was your first kid and you find out she got other baby daddies, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. Because sometimes it wasn't her fault for why she's single. Yep. You know, yeah, sometimes too, she was getting treated wrong, but I mean, women, you got to be strong too. Yeah. You can't mm-hmm. just letting anybody, these little dog ass dudes be, yeah, bro. you know, dog sprouting guy. in you. We're going to use that term. Absolutely. Don't, don't, you know? uh, don't ignore the red flags. And yep. definitely speaking of that, yep. you know, mm-hmm. we know they just passed, I know uh, with that. That yeah, we know they it. just That's overturned, just, uh, wow. Roe v. Wade, mm-hmm. um, just past week. And I personally, I don't understand, like, with all the stuff we have going on right now, you know, like, you know, you got a war going on somewhere in, you know, another country, gas prices are skyrocketing, uh, inflation is horrible, mm-hmm. um, like, That's mass, what we, mass shootings That's what we worry is a about. thing, gun control and gun violence yep. is a big, big, it's... It's not the topic is big, but they're not moving like it's actually yeah. affecting people's lives every day. Like we're not acting upon it. They're not like worried we about should. taking care of anything else. They're worried about controlling women. That's decisions. it. Yeah. And yeah. it's like wow. to me that's crazy because whether that's I agree top or of disagree the with it, list right now. Yeah, yeah. that that mm-hmm. like of all things, that's my whole thing. I'm like agree or disagree. It don't matter. <laughs> this is what this yeah. is what y'all worried right. about. This is what we got pro- people protesting about. This is what we That's got people crazy. Um, voting on. And it's like, oh, but I just see it as like, a, you know, it's just a start. You know, they want to go there and yep. then they want to push. You know, I seen them talking about the whole gay marriage thing. Oh, yeah. You know, yep. and then they, you know, I yeah. think they're going to just start slowly. Mm-hmm. And to me, it's bro, going backwards. whether I agree or disagree, and this is what I be trying to tell our listeners, our subscribers and everything. Whether I agree or disagree with your lifestyle, I'm never the type of person that's gonna tell you what to do. Yeah, and I don't, I don't feel like it's human nature for me to make you do anything that you don't want to do. If True. you, if a person come here right now and they gay, ain't none of us gonna be in here like, Ugh. Exactly. like nobody you know. around me act like that. Yeah, you know, and I don't feel like 
that decision is ours. Whether I don't know, whether I agree or disagree with your lifestyle has nothing to do with how I treat you as a human being. Actually. And what we're doing now is we're showing that, especially for the women, you know, we're taking yeah. their right away because uh, we're not even thinking about further, deeper uh, reasons and causes of people having yep. children, like mm-hmm. being raped or, you know, they're trying not to have children because they know that the chances of the the survival rate might be bad or, you know, mm-hmm. something in their, their bloodline or history or something mm-hmm. like that. You know, you can't just say, oh, well, just don't have sex then. You know, like, it's, it's just, it I've been hearing like all kind of ignorant responses to that, but I feel like as a human being, if God could give us free will, why are we trying to control each other? Mm-hmm. It's insane. That's I just my really don't get thing. the point. I just really like when I heard about it, I was just so confused. I'm like, why is this top priority? There exactly. has to be another meaning behind it, not to be on a conspiracy <laughs> issue. But I'm like, had, why? Yes. We why? just had deaths, exactly murders, wars, all this other stuff. Happening. A school shooting that they stopped mm-hmm. talking about. Mm-hmm. Like I don't hear about it no yeah, more. You just like hear that more and more about how the cops majority of them really did nothing. Like yeah, it's oh, like man. terrible. I've I'm been like, seeing clips of the cops. Sitting in there, knowing that with, ha- with the doors time, were unlocked, they just didn't go in. There. Like they yeah. feared for their own life, and they were only looking for their kids and stuff like that. From some of the clips, and uh, people were getting arrested for trying to go in there. To yep. and shout out to some of the cops, they were getting in trouble for like going in there. They were getting stopped, but I'm like, this point, bro. I mean, I don't know, bro. This world is just, I don't know. Just, yeah. just pray for this world, man. I mean, just big facts, bro. Because I just, I'm just, I just, I don't know. No, bro, and that's and that's a big thing because. I want to say 26 states um, already. They they have a law uh, where they automatically go ahead and you know in agreement with what the mm-hmm. the, the overturn was. Yeah, mm-hmm. uh, I forgot the term of it, but um, I want to say 26 states. So they're already they've already had to turn over things like the abortion clinics, and people have to oh, start yeah. choosing other ways and other places to go to. Yeah. You know, find the other locations. If even if you had an appointment for Monday, it was that it's quick. Crazy. Yep. In some of those states. So that's why they want us to get out there and vote uh, this year. So that way we can, you know, try to overturn that. So that way that's not something that happens on a, a general federal level. I and feel like leaving it to the states. Doing this, trying to control people's decisions on a lot of stuff. For instance, gun control, abortion, <clears throat> stuff like that. It's just going to lead to black market type uh, mm-hmm. directions yeah. for people. They're just going to be like, yeah. all right, cool, let me get some guns under the table. And it's going to be... Cool, let me uh, get an abortion under the table. Yeah. Like, that's yep. what's going to happen. It's more dangerous. Exactly. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I mean, I've already you know, heard, um, well, crazy. they're going to try to make a certain pill and stuff like that you could take before you have, you know, unprotected sex. And then once again, I mean, that's on some pharmaceutical type issue. I'm like, it's just like, there's always a pro and a con to... And people been stocking up on Plan Bs. Yep. Oh, yeah, they you have. Know, like, there's been... A, a lot of uh, they out of stock. Yeah, they yeah. out of stock in a lot of places. But, but you yeah. said what if you see, bro? If I see stock X, I mean, if I see Plan B on stock X, bro, I'm just gonna lose it. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, bro. It's probably gonna, gonna be on eBay. Any type of aftermarket yeah. is like, bro, this is what the world we live in nowadays. It's gonna be resale, the hot uh, supply like, and demand. The price gonna rise. Yeah, yeah. Really Trojan kind of. Well, I don't know. I got look this like Plan B for two hundred. Plan B for two hundred. Like it's gonna yeah. be crazy like that, bro. With the world we living in, with how much people are. Engaging in those mm-hmm. sexual acts now, like crazy. It's it's on a regular basis. I mean, obviously, you know, at the times we live in, people just saying, "Hey, fuck you." It's not like they already wasn't, but it's like, nah, yeah, like you can you can see somebody from across the world without even mm-hmm. like being there with them, you know. And yep. it's like y'all linking up, you know, you meeting and introducing yourself to people, and people are moving around more, traveling more. I'm like, cause back then they was doing it like crazy. Shoot. Yeah, yeah, they, they were. Like, got grandmas and grandmas with 20, 20, 15, 16 Oh man, I was like, bro, I'll what were y'all say, doing back I'll then? Just say this. That's all they was doing. Yeah, I'll just yeah. say this. Now yeah. it ain't just in your town no more. Now you going mm-hmm. traveling across state mm-hmm. and oceans. And you know, mm-hmm. getting you some, some having a vacation cat. and what what they say will stay here. What happens here? Yeah, just yeah stay, stay here. here. Getting some that foreign cat that's <laughs> you can only see on the close friends. Right, what's going down? Yep, I gotta get that. Oh, no, this wow. this ain't for they eyes. You know, <laughs> right, <laughs> see, green, green, rainbow, green, that's green. Yeah, <laughs> that's shit crazy. So, yeah. question to y'all, man. Since we we still talking yeah, about trying to Get address the back. fellas, have y'all ever been rejected? Like trying to talk talk to somebody new and they like oh no they shut you down oh yeah absolutely keep on going man i'm like no yeah next person (laughs) yeah it's kind of like having a blister man as a kid until an adult bro you just like you get numb to the first time the first time i was probably more like damn yeah yeah yeah. yeah. i was hurt the the very first time and then after that you you do it again you're like that's not too bad 
Okay. Yeah. Happens one more time, maybe, and then you're like, all right, okay. But okay. then you get some wins in the same you time. Start you start getting wins in the middle. Oh, okay. Yeah. So it's like, oh, okay. <laughs> no, dude, the the hell with you. Yeah. Right, cool. I think I was big on, like, hook me up in the beginning because I didn't want to be faced with the no. Oh. Um and two the hook for me, me up set up down. I yeah, remember yeah. them days. That's how I take hook me started. Hey, hey, you I got a homegirl? Oh, I didn't reach out. You know, yeah, hook me up. Yeah, yeah, one of them situations. And um, but from there, because I didn't want to hit the no, I didn't. I couldn't deal with the no. Like, I mean, I don't think you would probably go ape shit on them. But no, of course you know. not. No, just <laughs> yeah. just feelings wise. Mm-hmm. And then I kind of developed into a person where I just I didn't necessarily approach women like that yeah like it was kind of more like i had to know that i had to be in conversation with you mm-hmm. and know your vibe is what it is like i gotta know that when i shoot i'm gonna make it exactly yeah. like almost you start changing your my, game plan. yeah i my changed very it. first like serious relationship was like that so like i was more so like i i started like vibing with her she was yeah. cool and stuff we went to the dance cool all right cool <laughs> and then uh once i knew she was feeling me i was like all right cool let me go ahead and ask yeah, yeah. and then it's like, like boom because if you say <laughs> no like we went to dance. Exactly. Yeah. exactly i took you to french you, know, you, go there. Like you saw these dance moves so that it turned for me it turned to that for me like right after like you know towards the end of high school mm-hmm. that's when i kind of really start to build like my confidence just Same. like self love, bro. Yeah. Because you know, I was always yeah. the person that, you know, everything had to be right. I it took me, you know, I would be trying to make sure nothing was on my face in the morning, trying to go to school, always trying yeah. to and then after a while, bro, you just start to be like, Bro, bro, once you start loving yourself and you just start kinda lit, you know, moving in your confidence, that radiates it to, to women. Yeah. And you just start to like you don't even do certain things for them. You just do it you because have, that's who you yourself, are. Yeah. And then that Mm-hmm. Attracts them. It's like a magnet. They're like, oh, he, something about him. You know, ooh, you smell good. And then all the little. Probably like mm-hmm. sophomore, junior. Yeah. Junior area in high school when I was like real confident with that. I was yeah. like, okay, mm-hmm. this is how I do it. In the junior year going into the senior year? Yeah, mm-hmm. I was. Because before like, that, I was getting in relationships. It wasn't like from me approaching at all. It was just like, I like you. And I was like, okay. Uh, I, yeah. guess. <laughs> I guess that's how it was in my senior year. Because <laughs> like, right. prior to that, I was just so like low confidence, which is like crazy. I mm-hmm. look back now, I'm like, yeah, Brandon, you were tripping. And then some, my senior year is <laughs> like, damn, they just, I know, not to, of course, to my own horn, it's like they gravitated Dude. more towards me because I was always chill and whatnot. I was like, okay, damn, you know. So and then from then on in, I mean, they just pretty much went from there. Because it's something about so, not doing the most. Now, it's, I've always never been that type of guy. Damn, like I've just been always. Exclusive to myself, like not Fellas. overdoing. Some about not doing the most, bro. Not yeah, it attracts not me. Yeah. I've most. never slap box females in the that's damn hallway. The, that's like the turn off for a lot yeah, of people. Yeah, like, like mm-hmm. trying too hard. Yeah, trying like trying too hard is usually an L. Yep. Just sometimes the more chill approach is the best approach. I've oh, seen yeah, it for sure. Yeah, I've seen I was, boys yep. be trying to do the most at the clubs, flexing all this other stuff, and that's cool. I won't. I, let me rephrase that. It's not really cool because at the end I of the day, I thought to myself. I mean, I, I, I've right, done yeah. it a couple times. Right? Yeah. That's no, all. That's no. you about to be about to turn the toxic, <laughs> no. the toxic hat back around. Yeah. Yeah. A few dollars. You so about to turn? You had a click glimpse. Damn. About to turn his hat back around. Right. I never you know what, man? Shit. I, I, I am toxic. That. But nah, <laughs> it's, it's it's if that's your thing, that's cool. But we know why you're doing it because you're trying to show out like, well, I got this. You know what I'm saying? Hey, I got all this coming to my section. Boom, 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 boom. And it's I, funny because uh, uh, my homie that actually, you know, on the toxic stuff, he made a post. He mm-hmm. was like, yo, for all the niggas that be got money, throwing all the money, you know, buying out the club with full of bottles, you know, the girls, they, you know, they drink your stuff up, but they going home with the cool dude. They're not going home with you. You can spend all that money on the club. 50, you know, 20, 30,000 dollars in one night. Hell, but they're not going home with you. They're going home with the cool guys. Because all you all you inviting over there is leeches and negative yep. energy. That's it. Dang. Man, I can invest. There that. we go. That's an investment. You piss me off telling me that. Like, oh, 50,000. Yeah. I mean, niggas, I mean, niggas be talking about that shit. in the strip club. I'm just like, yeah, bro. Niggas, I, and then the strip club ain't nothing but a flexi competition. Yeah. And yeah. I see that, bro, every week on like Instagram yeah. stories and stuff. I'm like, like I understand. That's Special occasion made from time to time. All right, cool, but bro, I see niggas doing that shit like every week, bro. Yeah. Or just more a few times out 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 the year. I'm dropping just, their check. Wow, yeah. Time, Damn bills. Last Damn time I went to a strip bills. club, that ain't nothing but a flex competition. Nah, yeah. Yeah, last time, niggas. honestly, for me, I went by myself to yeah. the strip club. Yeah, it oh, was this twenty. Like, what, last week. No, nah, nah. <laughs> hell, not nah, definitely <laughs> not, 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 not not recently. 
Shit. Gold diggers. Well, and it was gold diggers, yeah. <laughs> no, it was the bachelors. It was the one two years ago for Zay, three years ago, Zay's party. But uh oh at the further, one, yeah, that was the one, but that was the yeah, one. Yeah, that was the yeah, first off of West Timer. Other than that, it was like gold diggers about like 2015. Ever since then, I was like, I'm doing strip clubs. They were just doing the most. Mm-hmm. I'm like, no, why am I here? I was like, why? Strip club so long ago. Yeah, it's saying. just you know, like you, no. You know there. They don't even charge you. Well, I mean, well <laughs> I did at the point, at the moment. I'm like, yeah, I want to see something. But at, I'm you like, you want to go in the back, bro? Y'all charging? No, y'all only play extra. a full song, and y'all charging for How a full much song. I like, I know, I never backstage. Yeah. Especially not of a sweaty female. I know that's my, like, y'all that's know always my been a turn off for me, so I've never been in the strip clubs like, like into them. My like turn that. off mm-hmm. about a strip club I'll, is it ain't nothing but for us to get turned on, not to really do nothing. That's, and that's, you got to pay true. for everything. Exactly. I'm too yeah, cheap. They, most of them got, got okay. boyfriends. Yep. yep. At the crib. Would you nah, okay? sometimes they in there. Like, that's my baby. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They right there. Right? Hey, hey, hey. Like, oh, yeah. Hey, hey, hey. Pay, pay my phone bill. Yeah. too aggressive. Yep. But, you, but on the cool, some dudes like that. Like, bro, yeah. that's another thing it's, too. And it's like that's. I'm starting to realize how common it is for dudes to want their chick to be shown. You know, a lot of OnlyFans oh, yeah. models that I like, had, they I'm got husbands. And people like, like that shit. I don't know. What I've never is. been into that. Nah, but, I never. Hey, people not, like that. Not stuff. to me. Not that, that's for my eyes only. Like, nah, I right. can't. So, I mean, I feel like exclusivity. Cold my woman there being we go. exclusive mm-hmm. to me is is more you know attractive. Yeah. The fact that she's not exclusive anymore, I'm like, what is like? It's not as uh, it's not as special. Yeah. Yeah. And then to me, I'm you know maybe this is just a me thing, and you know because we talking to the fellas, right? We fellas. Mm -hmm. I think when I was like younger, when I was single, women with clothes, like sexy outfits, was more attractive to me than just already showing me what. I agree. Yeah. I've always because remember when they start doing that? Like, remember when they first start getting comfortable with the see through clothes? I don't yeah. know if y'all remember that, but it was a little it was a little stage where they started mm-hmm. to have like the little see through clothes, and you can like see their nipple yeah. through like the little body suit mm-hmm. or whatever. And niggas was just like, "Oh man, like man, oh, that's what they doing now." Like, man, she naked, and then it started to I might become more gets common. When I used to see that, too. yeah, I'd be yeah. like, mm, I ain't really "But good. women don't realize, bro. Like a, a woman in like a nice dress, like a nice yep. fit, oh, will yeah. always just like when they dress up for like the." Just like I, that's why they post like for the Grammys and the Oscars and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. When the women dress up, it's like more appealing. Yeah, a lot yeah. of times that's yeah. that's how I used Especially to. Especially if they fitting it right. Like, yeah, like always classy. Yeah, they, something about that. Something that's matching mm-hmm. a body type, bro. Because it don't matter what body type you are, there are clothes that complement exactly whatever curves you Thanks. have. And if you know what you're doing when it comes to the dress game. You can appeal a lot of like mm-hmm. people, like a lot of dudes. That was my thing. And I, I feel like your your ratio from good to bad dudes increases to good the good side. When you, you know more dressy. Yeah. Yeah. A lot of times when you're showing off, a lot of times during that period, like you are attracting the guys that niggas come at you. You're not trying to get, and then you talk shit about them right after mm-hmm. that. But that's what you're attracting, because mm-hmm. I mean, because we all know niggas don't like working. Niggas don't like working for it. Yeah, and they want it to come like, easy. I should be, I should be able to show my body, blah blah blah. And like, and I get can. that, you get but that. again, like, we're guys, so we know what guys. Just don't get upset when you have that type of you know energy come it's, towards you. It's like, like we just, know the dudes that are looking at you at yeah. the time. So they not, like, like what made you want to rock that? Okay, being a being a guy. Like, so let's just because yeah. I want to I want to help even this for the guys, but just just as a tidbit for the women. Mm-hmm. So let's say uh, Brandon Ross. A woman coming here right now, new chick y'all never seen before, pretty mm-hmm. attractive. She comes in with no shirt, like no shirt, like on. no shirt, no shirt on, just titties out, just titties out. Damn, what's the see? <laughs> I would be aroused as a man, but I'd be right. like, why? But, but the, why, yeah. why? What made nah, you want to well, do the this? first thing you said first, was, yeah. damn, was you? Yeah, exactly. I'm like, damn. but let's say the same chick come on with a nice little throwback Bulls T-shirt or something. I can definitely see the potential still. Like it's just right, but yeah. it's a different vibe. It's a different, it's a different vibe because she got clothes on. But you're not. Your brain doesn't automatically you say yeah. damn. I'm like, oh damn, that's Naturally, a tough. You're it's two different dams actually. Because yeah, it's, a, it's, a it's damn dam. like. Oh, I wanna. She can still look good in the face. I mean, just say. But. Oh yeah, you give me my charger. No, for my laptop. I'm sorry. I text her and then I didn't even respond. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, <laughs> so so yeah, same chick walk in. Your damn is the, is because of how she look, but it's not. You're not so into like mm, yeah. it's the first because like, you automatically you imagine what you would do with what you saw. The first thing you're gonna see yeah. is oh she's naked. 
like the top half. Oh, she's naked. But if she comes in like with the jersey, it's like okay, that's a cool jersey. You you may notice something else. Like yeah. okay, you know what I'm saying? I like a I like a drip or whatever. But you don't yeah. go straight. You don't go straight nah, for it. I Damn. suck on them titties. Yeah, like you know what I'm saying. Especially if they look good and they perky. Oh boy. <laughs> I mean, well, you could tell even with the shirt on. I'm sorry. Boing. Oh, yeah, take it easy yeah. now, man. Oh boy. Let's get you. Let's reel you back here. <laughs> oh right. boy. That's, that's back here. Would you mind there, plugging boy. that for me up there? Well, whoever can get it. Why? Well, thank you, man. I appreciate that. <laughs> My knees they not as good. I'm gonna unravel it, but thank I ain't gonna do. My knees says the dancer. <laughs> thank you, sweetheart. Yeah, my knees ain't there, man. My knees ain't there like they used to be. I feel you. We ten years older from the. Thank you, baby. Facts, facts, facts. Hey, Thanks, baby, Nisha. Woo! Hey. She saved the pie, right? But now nah, you—that's that's, that's kind of what I'm trying to get. Mm-hmm. You know, some women understand sometimes. Like, yeah, you can definitely just show what you want. I mean, even if you let's go, let's let's be a little bit more realistic. All right. If a chick come in with a white beater, no bra. Keisha Cole, white, yeah, straight. Yeah. I mean, nipples you, on ten. I like, mean, you're, I'm, you're, that's yeah. gonna be the first thing. I'm yeah. like, okay. But, and know, although she may can be comfortable in wearing that, yeah. you can't stop denying Thank the you. fact that yeah. you're thinking about yeah. Ooh, Absolutely. What, you, what you want to do to you. <laughs> exactly. So <laughs> to be oh, honest, bro, if somebody yeah. walked in here like that, I'll be like, okay, obviously, like just going back to the top, it's like, is you doing a photo shoot or something? You, you ain't tell us about like uh, so I, I will know. instantly a microsecond be Don't on, on professional ish. All right, well, Boy, yeah, I get you. I got you. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, you know, I gotta be professional. I'm like, okay, she's naked. All right, obviously, there's a reason. So, okay, bam. You know, I ain't gonna be on creep mode like that. So, no, you're gonna immediately be like, damn. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, I'll be like in my head, yeah, but I'm still you keep might a composure. There at, yeah, at yeah. Time, like, okay, yeah. Like, right. <laughs> and then once you find a reason why she's here, it may even change your damn. Like, yeah. Oh, yeah. damn. Okay, well, yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, damn. But the first damn you was on was the damn you stuck with. It's yeah. a lot of different dams than that. Yeah, it damn. Is, right? Damn. Right, it is. <laughs> So that's what I'm trying to get people yeah. to see and the women to understand, like, yeah. you know, a guy is just being a guy. You know mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Especially that's if he's young. Especially mm-hmm. if he's young and single. I mean, bro, bro. You when, can't change when, human nature. When we was young, like, before. <laughs> Michael Jackson said, tell him that it's human nature, man. Bro, <laughs> before, <laughs> before <laughs> popping in it, getting in it the first time, like, that's all you're thinking about. Mm-hmm. I Absolutely. wonder what it feel like. I wonder, I wonder, mm-hmm. I wonder. And even yep. to the fellas, I mean, we talking, right? Come on, guys. Yeah. We we in this like thing. I said, Gold Diggers the first time when thing. I went, stepped in there and saw everything, I was like, wow. I was a little 19 year old lad. And, and probably you know, yeah. not the lad. You just know <laughs> wars was started over this one yeah. thing that start with a P. Yeah. And you just wanted to know what that felt like. And oh, yeah. when was it going to be your lucky day? Yep. You know what I'm saying? So whenever, I mean, and then you got your your times where you're, you're growing up, you're developing, and you know, you. Mm-hmm. you you know, you're seeing things and you're quick to to uh, get excited, mm-hmm. yeah. you know, when certain things happen. You know, you're for waking example, up in the morning. For example, to expound <laughs> on what you was just, you stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, for example, to expound that, on, on what you was talking about with saying having somebody, you know, a random person come in here half naked. Even then, like, say you about to go to a, a function and you on a, you know what I'm saying, you on the phone and you hit the infamous question. So who all coming? You got some girls, you know, you got some I'm uh, scarred girls by that coming question. or whatnot. Don't say that question. Don't and say that that's, that. that's those type of questions. Boys will perk their ears up. They'll yeah. stop playing Burr? the game. They'll listen just to. She she does? She she got friends? Yeah, she got friends. Yeah. Oh, she, for real? She going to bring her home. <laughs> all the way. Fuck Niggas that. would get excited about that because now it's like your chance of possibly hopping on something <laughs> just increased tonight. So you pulling out your fresh fit, you pulling out your fresh cologne, exactly. you, pulling out, you pulling out everything. After the bro. night. Yeah, <laughs> don't leave your girl around me. Real thing, play bro. Yeah. That's my nigga. For Especially if it's like a house party or something. Oh, like that, oh yeah, house party, man. Oh yeah. Oh, house parties is where you really, oh. really get the pull mm-hmm. because Club that's cool. cool. But house but parties, house parties. That's when they play because the, it's more. Intimate. Call me Mister Hit that. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> when they got to the slow jam <laughs> part and you got on the wall, I'm laying down. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> say yes, say. Yes. Until it's on A lot of random uh, Roll ups Pop in <laughs> Yo pew, boy pew, pew, Get it on And in. you always you, it's, it's crazy We talking about this bro It's like It was like We analyze this But you always knew You was in a good situation When you get in the roll up And she looked and back she looked back oh, yeah. keep going and keep going That oh. was always a dub That was a dub <laughs> Woo And Absolutely. you see your homies Getting rolled up too You just like And we just like Yeah 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 <laughs> 
It's like a mission complete. It's like a proud yeah. moment. Yes, you know, bro. Oh, bro, you just being like, my, my dog. nigga, bro. <laughs> oh, dog, that was always you just looking at it like you in that position. I remember, <laughs> man. Me and the homie K used to be at all the clubs, bro. We used to do the whole <laughs> counts. We would count how many roll ups we got. Mm-hmm. Hey, man, it I just got one fun, over there bro. on the corner, bro, on the south east side, man. You better go and walk over there, man. There might bro. be something over there. And, and that was a different time. That, that was a different time. We used to bro. scope them roll ups. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Again, I remember I said this on here before. I'll never forget one of the best rejections I got during the roll up when this girl was in the middle, and I'm talking about everybody just around her. Just she was just like kind of doing a whole vibe yeah. on her own, and I'm like, damn, she kind of. And everybody was just looking at her, and I'm like, ain't nobody gonna get on it. Like she doing enough to like give you the little, you know. Yeah. So I walked up, and she must have hit me with the Mm-mm. the like as soon as that she hit me with that. That no, 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 and then just start rubbing on me, going down. Ah! I'm like, I mean, well, what are we doing? What you want me to do? You giving me two different, uh, like, I'm confused. Yeah. I'm confused. Don't tease. You know, I'm just gonna stand here, okay? I'm like, you don't have to do that, but I mean, shit, you trying to, I mean, <laughs> shit, if you right. won't, I mean, you trying to get straight to it. Right. I mean, I was trying to, you know, get your name first. For show. But I'm unknown too. Bases right now. <laughs> Look, I'm unknown too. <laughs> I'll get into it. But I mean, that's just how it is. And again, especially well, before. That's how it was. It's, it's not like that now, bro. Especially before you got into, you know, into the the land, the 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 walls. The promised land, as uh, they say. Like I sugar walls. The walls. The, yeah, wall, the, the walls. sugar walls. I mean, because, you know, and I do want to touch sweet, on that. I want to touch on that walls. in case people are not there yet. Yeah, what uh, they mean by sugar walls? It mean? may be losing oh, your virginity, basically. Let's yeah, go ahead. Yeah, yeah. I'm going to stop beating around the bush. But in case you haven't been there yet, I will say this. Mm-hmm. If you can wait, wait. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Don't rush like, it. I'm not gonna be one of them dudes like man, you hear nothing. Man, get you some, you know. But I mean, if Take you can hold off and wait, I would wait. Mm-hmm. And I know that's probably yeah. contrary because, yep. to what a lot of people believe and probably expected me to say. But I mean, you really want to make sure because when you start having sex with women and different ones and different ones, I feel like you're giving a piece of them to you oh, every you time. Are. Mm-hmm. You know, and it's that, that soul ties thing is true. I you know, you just I'm you good. giving them pieces of you every time. And mm-hmm. I know we young. I mean, when you young, you just be like, you just trying to go out there and get it. Because I was there, mm-hmm. you know. But just from experience, I realized like, damn. Sometimes I sit back and like, man, I wish I would have kept myself, you know, from certain people being mm-hmm. able to say, you know, we even engaged. You know, do y'all, do y'all regret y'all uh, the person y'all lost your opportunity to? No, Mm-mm. nah, nope. Okay, all right, no, <laughs> no, nope, not at all. Nah, hell not. <laughs> I wouldn't say I it. It was just. It was I mean, cool. for me, it was the only thing about losing your virginity, and for mine, she was already experienced. Same here. So I guess yeah, mine, me, mine was too. My biggest. <laughs> I was, like, oh, yeah. 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 I was biggest, a lost boy. My yeah, biggest yeah. fear was performance. <laughs> what I do? Right. <laughs> was performance? Oh yeah. There? <laughs> yeah. Whoa, whoa. Well, you just, <laughs> She said she said I was okay, which I feel was a lie. <laughs> but 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 performance was big for me because uh-huh. we in high school, you know, and you know, all you know is, hey man, I put it down. Niggas was lying. Cap- but, yeah, all lot you know, <laughs> was definitely capping. But that was the thing. Like, yeah. man, you gotta put it down. And then the chick, you know, you wanna be able to Please her, and not only that, but you don't want when somebody asks her, you want oh, he's mm-hmm. whack or he you know, yeah, so it was a lot of pressure. BDR. Yeah, it's a lot of pressure. For those who don't know what that is, bad dick bad report. Dick report. Yeah, um, that, it's a lot of pressure <laughs> when it comes to you know when losing you your virginity, it. especially to somebody that already experienced. So mm-hmm. for me, that was a a, a big thing. Mm-hmm. So, um, yep. but yeah, other than no, nah, I didn't. I didn't regret. I mean, again, I regret just being peer pressured yeah. into it, right? Oh, uh, okay. Because I felt like I had to do it. Because oh. you remember me and the homies, we was just like, all right, yeah. let's see who's going to lose it last type shit, you know. And <laughs> Pretty sure I was last. I, but I was not. I think I was. Peer pressure yeah. didn't work too well on me. So yeah. well, well, when I was in school. Oh, school. I went, school, I went yeah, against okay, the yeah. grain a, a lot of, uh, on a lot of things. So, like, yeah. they try and I'm like, eh. <laughs> but to, to be funny, don't judge me, but I used to be scared because when niggas used to talk about it that, that actually didn't have sex before, they would say bust a nut. Um, and the term scared me. Bro, hey, you <laughs> nigga, scared. me too. Shit. Yo, Damn, like, like, bro, like, ah. I was terrified of a lot of shit. Ah. Like, yo, wait. Do we 
Do our nuts bust and then regrow for us oh, to have sex? I just bro, bro I didn't it was know. Confused, was confused. No, it was know. the uh, the pop that cherry. I'm like, it's, what they mean by that shit? Like, well, shit, I knew the pop the cherry. Like, she, oh kinda, yeah, they got to bleed. I'm like, what you mean bleed? What, what, it was the right. well when I found out about pop the cherry, it was like, right, but <laughs> all the I whole heard, man, the whole yeah. busting nut was not a. It didn't uh, sound it attractive. attractive yeah, it didn't, no, I didn't, like, why yeah. would you want to bust your neck, yeah. bro? Like that shit hurt. Terrible. How yeah. you hit yourself in the neck? I don't want no part of this. I don't like, want to lose my virginity. You can't ever. even you can't right. even nudge your nuts and not get boy, bent like, over yeah. for like a minute. Yep, boy, boy, that after effect, I was bitch, a, too. Like I, was a woo. I, got, yep. I got tapped like from a little oh like see bro, it's, then the, it's the little one. Bro, play like that too. Remember niggas used to do the little neck check, bro. That shit. Boy, that's, that's how you I get will knock your ass out of some shit. <laughs> this is a this is no judgment zone. So yeah, yeah. busting the night was a scary <laughs> term. I didn't like that term. And I was like, oh, I can wait on that. I'm good. Mm-hmm. Yes, yeah, that was one I'm thing. Good. Shit, I don't know about y'all. I like my nuts. Shit. Yeah, like <laughs> absolutely. Niggas, be all about the nah, nah, bro. It ain't what we mean by oh. Well, until you actually do it. Well, I mean, even when I was younger, oh. I literally. Oh. <laughs> Before the the term bust the nut, I literally thought heaven how. So girls get pregnant. You, all you do is just wow. stick the penis in there, and that girl you ain't get pregnant. That? Like mm. you ain't see the gates when you uh, your first time. My first time, I was popping. like, "What is this? Nah. What is this substance? Yeah, <laughs> what was, is this?" My, I was very I uncomfortable. Was confused. <laughs> I was like, "I don't, I don't think I'm, I don't, I'm gonna just keep this to myself. I, I don't want to tell my mom about this or nothing. I'm gonna just, yeah. I'm confused. I hope uh, this don't uh, happen to you. I was already paying bills at, at that point, so I don't give a damn. I'm a man, <laughs> shit. Hey, I'm Ross started about to pee on himself. Yeah, bro, I was so <laughs> shit. confused. What is it spilling? You got that first take it? I got a little bit of it, like. Got the wet, the wet, the wet wipes. Yeah, <laughs> I pray, my baby. I ain't mad. It's just look, you just need I the people. Just, you ain't the only one. Nigga. We all got. Shit, I could have. Oh, I definitely bro. uh eat kids all of them. Yeah, I'm like, sure you was <laughs> petrified, bro. I need yeah. yeah. like, that. Yeah. Like, what is this? <laughs> But I didn't need a kid. I was still confused. <laughs> I was like, I need a napkin. I, but I just, yeah. It's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a part of the growing experience. It is. And yep. to, that's where communicating with your kids, like mm-hmm. the young men, that way they'll know, like, they're not crazy. You know, that's mm-hmm. why we have to kind of start to communicate with our youth, you know, mm-hmm. to let them know, hey, bro, you having these feelings for a reason. You're not just uh, a maniac. <laughs> you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah. We all go through those hormonal changes to where we just like, damn, she's fine all of a sudden. I didn't even notice you. And you know? I, I want to kind of go back to the point of, <clears throat> for the fellas, don't be chasing the vagina, even yeah, if no. it is going to be your first time. Yeah, because bro. in our situation, lead you to a wrong path, talking bro. about, we ain't really just chasing it. It just kind of <clears throat> came to you. And that's just yeah, life absolutely. in general. When you go out there and, oh, my only purpose is to try to get laid, bro. You nah. may end up in a, a bad situation. You may bro. end up Absolutely. messing around with somebody that now you have a kid with and you don't even like. You feel me? So you want to let it come to you they naturally. Say 18 Just, years old with some, like, with a 30 I minute dude session chase, or some shit. Not knowing that the girl got a, a, a crazy boyfriend. Yeah, and that too. And she like, I'm not really with him, but I'm yeah. with him. No, no. And then you end up in that situation about to get shot. Like, I'm yeah. seeing oh, crazy I'm shit. Oh, I'm not. <laughs> so that's and why. it's dangerous because of the diseases. Yeah, Absolutely. That too. We that's forget. a very big well, Niggas part. forgot. They, you mm-hmm. know, AIDS and HIV didn't disappear. Stuff. You can. Like, you, know, you can still catch shit. It just COVID we talking about. You know what I'm <laughs> saying? <laughs> that's that's some shit. Stay with that you. Don't have now a vaccine. You got monkey pox. Yeah. I was just about to say, they got the new monkey pox now. Yeah. So I'm straight, bro. And some people aren't clean. Some of your crushes don't even... Mm. Bro, Gee, bro, that is a real hygiene. Bro. Boy, that you is just hygiene. Oh my god! Cause yeah. sm- I say this: smells stick with you. It like, does. Smells will linger. little molecules in your brain. <laughs> you gotta yeah. be, bro. Just smell mm-hmm. go into and your brain and just sit there. It be in the, back. the the guys that be lusting and going crazy over these Instagram models. <clears throat> they don't even be smelling the greatest. Yeah, I'm, when you when you may even meet them, and these are real things like yep. people that y'all praise and worship. Be like, oh man, they look so good. Boom, 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 boom. I bet, I bet her vagina tastes so sweet. Taste. See, Niggas go straight. Why would that be the first thing? I can never thing. understand that because I've never been that way over uh, like, no. vagina. So like, yeah. I, shit, I turned the, I turned the girl down naked. So I was like, put my clothes back on and walked out. I was like, yep. 
But what happened? Like, what, I've always did, had control over that. So he wanted. Uh, <laughs> no, like, why did you just like? <laughs> I just, it didn't feel right. Oh, okay. Feel right. Yeah. It was like one of them like the like, like, I'm an energy person. So yeah. I'm that's energy. that's good. Okay. That's good. That's something that's don't feel right. I know like, some she said or something or like you smell something. I don't something? Even remember. Okay. Like, all right. Well, that's good enough. Getting up and being like, no, nope. nah, I can't. We good. And she just hurt. Activity right there. And she was hurt as hell. And I was sitting there like, I don't give a fuck. I got to go. Because I had like a crazy. I've always had a crazy control over like my. Sexual activity, I guess. That's a good like, thing, like, man. Except for like my first chick, like I had a little, yeah. you know, because that's your heart. So you're yeah, like, of course. You're stupid and you do yeah. stupid shit. But yeah. besides that, after that, I was like, I'll never make that mistake or get that vulnerable again. So if I felt something was off, uh, this ain't Bye. It. And that's <laughs> real, bro. A lot of guys would not do that. They would like, well, we here. Exactly. Fuck it. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. <laughs> but to have that type of discipline and that awareness, that's what we try to put out there Wait to the fellas. Minute. What? <laughs> it made me think about that video where that dude met up with that chick and it was a midget. Oh, oh, oh my God. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You talking about yeah, that video. Yeah, like, bro, we here, shit. No, that's definitely some like fucking moments. She... You do get those for sure. Uh, I mean, you the the homie said, you hit though, didn't you? <laughs> like, <sighs> Look, I told Absolutely. you I hadn't had sex in a while. Like, no. I would have just said no discrimination. <laughs> hey. None. He said, what's she like in the height? She bad. <laughs> 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 hey, you know a nigga down bad. But yeah, like, man. Nah, you definitely had them times. You're like, fuck it. Hey, we here. Oh, yeah. Everybody had a fucking moment, bro. Yeah. We, yep. we can all had a we fucking here. moment. Hey, all right, shit. Don't tell nobody. Yeah, this ain't it. This, this, this ain't this, me. This ain't this ain't me. It's not my normal self. <laughs> this is not my normal. This is not self. my normal self. Don't finish and then get to the mirror. Look oh, at yeah. you. Look at you. Don't, yeah, don't even look at you. No, don't. Don't even look at me. Keep walking. <laughs> Clean yourself up. Go, <laughs> you in a damn shower? You disgusting. You sitting down? She's still yep. in your bed, isn't she? Look at you. She's smiling and you. Why she ain't left yet? Why she ain't left? Kick her out. Oh, you ain't Kick got her no, out. You ain't got no goddamn. And hey, my mama yeah. call. I gotta go fix the lights. You don't deserve to be here. Either. <laughs> well, well, so yeah. go. So fellas, man, focus on yourself, man. Focus, focus on, yes, on man. what's important to you. The women will come to you. I've I've, I've learned bro, this, bro. Success brings women. Yes. Facts. You don't Not have to go. Yeah. But they yeah. bring women. You don't have to be flashy. Women. You don't have to be chasing after it. Focus on yourself that's and you'll be statement. surprised who come around you. And then yeah. that's when you need to start weeding out the, the we, red flags. We, you to, yep. we, that's when you need details. to start paying attention to the, the nope. social media posts, how she feel about certain things. Hell, if you want to get in really into your bag, if she not like doesn't like say, I know my stepmom, shout out to you. I know she'd be happy if I say this. But like for some people, religion. You know what I'm saying? So it's yep. big for me, like you, for me personally, I, I can't, it's hard for me to date someone that doesn't like believe in God. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? If I walk yeah. in your apartment, you got an upside down cross. Hey, hell, hell, hell no. Hey, that's, that's, you got to get a turn around right there. <laughs> yep. I'm but good. Now, by the time you turn around, the door going to close. Come here. You mind. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> like, I made a mistake, please. <laughs> you being there like, fuck it. Get some of this demon pussy. <laughs> Some of y'all would definitely man. fuck some demon pussy, bro. That's oh no, hundred percent. Wait, uh, don't be a menace. Yep. Uh, uh, oh yeah, mm-hmm. don't get caught. Told you I get a little crazy. Like, come on, I, I, come on, I, I already good. know. Sure. I some of y'all. I told you I get a little crazy. I know some of y'all. That nigga's like, ah. I know there's some guys out there that would definitely say, "Whoop!" Since I'm here. <laughs> Oh, 100%. Oh, yeah, I, know, I know guys that'll hit a stick, so. <laughs> hey, I just told my wife that, bro. We was talking about something, and I said, bro, because we would compare a certain. Uh, I can't oh, so Bro, if it got some wet moss on it, too. Like, oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's all I need. Yeah. Like, the, what's the dude name? It'd be just smashing random shit. Oh, oh yeah, yo. Jay, 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 That's the Punani Pounder. <laughs> like. <laughs> It's people really bro, like that. I'm trying though. to figure out why they got peaches and fruit shaped like that. Yeah, though. they know what they doing. Shit, y'all. I'm trying to turn people Papaya on with food. Penetrate. Pa- there we go. That's a Papaya <laughs> penetrator. Oh, but what somebody you get him. Somebody get him. They be trying to turn you on with fruit. And I'm like, man, why are y'all playing with the fruit it's like that? Weird, going right? into the middle. Then why are you in the fruit section right now? <laughs> Don't ask. <laughs> somebody, and I, I, I ain't looking for no help, young blood. I'm somebody trying to just put on social media. Mm-hmm. Uh, yesterday, I saw this shit. They was like, they showed uh, Nala, 
when she was grown and fighting oh, with Simba laying tips? back. Oh. No, no, no. She oh. was laying back on the grass when her and Simba was fighting. Oh, bro. And she did that little Dad, look. Yeah. And then somebody was like, bro, I don't know why the f- Disney was playing with me like this. He said, I've been looking for some lion pussy ever since. <laughs> And why they had I don't know about that, but as so a, bad. when I saw that, I felt that too as a little kid. I'm <laughs> yeah, like, yeah, damn, like, 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 it was fine when he was a kid. I'm not uh, looking at you like that. Like, hey, no, you better hit that. <laughs> you better, Man, you you better, better, I, I don't she, know what you're doing. She did that little look. She did that little look. That, that look, I'm like, no, nah, that, that's a human face look. You better go line. That's a I'm open. When the like the grass had lit up, it was like a beautiful area. Yeah, I was like, hey, I'm gonna grow the scenery, but my boy, you my It's only right, my boy. My boy, Timon and Pumbaa out here. My boy, Timon and Pumbaa out there with the vocals for you, bro. Exactly. Yeah. They, they were the perfect God. setup, boy. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> the love tonight. <laughs> bro. Oh, she can. already said she see the king and you inside. My bro, bro, you got to finish that. I'm going to show you this king. It's it's work, that. All right. work. We rooting for you. <laughs> 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 I mean, we really was like that. Like, back in college, you had your homeboy. You like, did, did you smell? Oh, yeah. You like, ah. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Yeah, girl. <laughs> Not the. It's always yeah, a story. Girl. So, bro, bro. So, I was in the so, whip, so, right? They come out smiling. If you smiling, we good. <laughs> so, bro, I was like, man, whoopty whoop. Or you got that one friend come out and be like, she wasn't on shit. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's, that's the exact man. quote. She wasn't on shit. <laughs> Immediately. She wasn't talking about it. Oh, so you ain't hit. They ain't about shit. <laughs> they wasn't about nothing. And it's the craziest shit we used to do to impress women. Mm-hmm. That just takes. Absolutely. But it just show you too, like how nature is. Like yep. um, when you see animals mm-hmm. and they be doing like the little dances and, like and stuff like that. And stuff. It's they crazy how they can like do you that. see nature. Yeah, yeah. You know? That's what the male figure would always do. It would like be be fancy and show out. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Impress. It's impressing so that way it can get. The, the girl or the you know the whatever <laughs> the, and then impregnate them or you know keep their get, get, get offspring get keep their genes going praise. yeah like, bro I've seen there's, my a, God. there's a certain <laughs> type nature. of uh, jellyfish or something <clears throat> like blowfish whatever it actually makes like a pattern on the, in like the sand on the ground in the sea I'm like how the hell do you know how to do that? That's they. That's they. They know that's how they to make code. some form of art, and they say they only do it to impress the female, like pufferfish or whatever. Mm-hmm. And that's I'm what like, dude, bro, that's what dudes do. That's why. In another conversation, all the same, life, I was man. like, bro, if women realize how much power they had, like, yep. like for real, for real, not yeah. on no like OnlyFans bag, but we talking yeah. about some like, no, not even that. Like, yeah. you niggas can't be helped, bro. Because <laughs> so, yeah, I mean, we, <laughs> some of these niggas. Is just, they hey, finish. Yeah, finish. Hey, let me, I'll give you a thousand for a piggy toe pick. I'm like, huh? Bro, what? What the hell you about to do with that, man? Can't Nothing. like looking at some we, shit. We ain't talking to you. Piggy toe. They're going to give you half of it. Bro, hey, like, man, nigga, it's some, so much we just like the old man. I'll give you the rest of my pinky toe. The old man. <laughs> right. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. You ain't saying nothing. Yeah, what's your cell, baby? I ain't know the rest of them. Baby, now, what's your cell? I swear. Like, bro, like, dudes will be on the phone, just going back to the sugar pops. They be on the phone and they be just talking to the women and then paying Shoot. bills. Mm-hmm. I need you to talk to me for thirty minutes so that way I can pay your light bill. Like, mm-hmm. Nigga, it's one eight hundred lines. You can so, call uh, like uh, unlicensed psychiatrist. So it's just like, go bro. Omegle or something, bro. <laughs> <laughs> what the you hell know man? what? I think you on the something. No, on Omegle, bro. Meet some random people. Well, I don't know nothing about no over. What's this over? He, y'all talk about? I think mm-hmm. he's on to something. I yeah. think all the sugar daddies out there need to go on Omegle. Go on Omegle, bro, yeah. and meet people. Yeah, but nah, cause then. The age, you don't be knowing who's old enough. True, this is true. It's always a, it's always a, a stipulation to yeah. it. Yeah, always something. I mean, but granny, they doing the same thing with the people that they mean. They like fucking. That's true. That's true. <laughs> they way younger. Like we talking about decades. So. I don't know, man. I, I is that okay. that app where they be switching video? Calls? Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's just random <laughs> that video shit chat. Is weird. Yeah, I was on that one I time. I was like, what the fuck am I on? Yeah, it, it definitely. Get, I said we should do that one time, you, man. Like, then do it on the road, pay like for the Patreon. Mm-hmm. Oh yeah, okay, I was gonna do it on the Patreon. Yeah, they be doing some wild dudes shit. Dudes be uh, on there like, yeah, they be. like, what the fuck is going on in this app, bro? <laughs> now bring me back to that point. <laughs> that shit weird. Some niggas is lost. That yeah, shit beyond lost. lost, lost like, some bro. of you fellas are just not gonna be able to get saved. Yep. yep. And that's okay. You know, not everybody's. Gonna, <laughs> I mean, for real, not everybody's like, gonna nah, be saved, fam, bro. Like we gotta understand that. Once we face that reality, and some niggas. Bro, it's just some niggas that just don't want to be sane. They they nope. vibe with just being 
off and that you just have to let them rock. Absolutely. That mm-hmm. shit is crazy. Man. It's just like some criminals. Some niggas just want to go kill. Like they don't yep. give a damn no what they're taking reason. away from. Mm-hmm. They just do it just because they can or they yeah. you know, they have the means and the resources to. So yeah. I mean that's just what it is. But yeah, some of y'all are not gonna get saved, but I really hope the majority of you do and I hope this information was able to <clears throat> at least a little piece yeah, to I hope. You know, just it's some little just stuff. Focus on yourself. Focus be on you yourself. King. Don't Let's be go out here trying to rush into no relationships or rush into messing with somebody. You know what I'm saying? Read the signs. Pay attention to the signs. They're there. You just got to pay attention to them. And, you know, just really work on yourself. I think Absolutely. that's the message mm-hmm. of this whole yep. video is for fellas to work, work on, on you. yourself. Even when you're dealing with something, heartbreak, breakups, bad relationships, whatever, bro. There's always room to grow mentally. There's always room to grow spiritually. There's always room to grow physically. Find things that will help you get over whatever situation. Gotta find your happiness, man. Find your happiness, man. Find a positive in that negative situation. That's really what you need to be doing. And and don't let it, you know, change you, like who you are. So, like, a lot of people, they tend to... Uh, get get a negative situation and they use that as the excuse of yeah. why mm-hmm. this happened to them or why they're doing this or why they're going to put fuel on somebody's mm-hmm. door. Nah, door bro. Shit like yeah. that. But no, 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 no. The case is you need to work on yourself and okay, worry about go. your energy, protecting your energy, and that's key. Protect Facts. your energy, my boy. Yeah. Protect your energy. And I will say for the people that, um, you know, for the good guys out there that good do want to take women out on dates and stuff, yeah. uh, I always say this. take you, Take a nice chick out on a date and when it comes time to pay, act like you forgot your wallet. Then you're going to see who you're dealing with. Because that's, that's my a good play. Um, oh, damn. I, oh. You got to sell it, though. You got to oh sell it. God. Oh, my God. Yo, 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 oh, my God. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God. Split the check, oh please. Uh-huh. <laughs> Split. Well, <laughs> this, uh, oh, yeah, this was nice. Um, see what you yeah. do. Split like Oh, no, I got it. It's cool. Split like a boy. That oh man, it's music. Ooh, oh, it's a beautiful that feeling, boy. man. Oh yeah, bro. it's a beautiful feeling. Boy, man. you hear that? Yeah. Don't worry, I got it. Got it's it cool. I I'm got it. I'm tell you, that's <laughs> those are the little signs. Don't fast. Yeah, don't right. do that. <laughs> those are the little signs that you gotta realize. Mm-hmm. Like, if a woman is willing to pay, cause she ain't worried about all that in between. Oh, the woman, who you gotta pay first date? That makes you even wanna. You know, do it even more. It makes you want to mm-hmm. cater to the moon. Just Damn. and that's some, that's <laughs> for confirmation that this wasn't just a free meal for her. Like, yeah. she's actually interested in you. You know, she wants to be more. Exactly. Cool. You know, yeah, and do something where both of y'all can uh, kind of talk, not yeah. watch a movie. Yeah, because yeah. yeah. you're Movies not talking. Never great do something where y'all can like get to know each other. Mm-hmm. An activity. You know, what I'm mm-hmm. saying, go to an art museum, somewhere where y'all can have conversation and talk. Mm-hmm. And you yeah. know, communicate while you're doing whatever activity it is that you're doing. Free game, free game. You know, take her ass to an yeah. escape room. See if she gonna get you out of a room if you're in a situation. Like, <laughs> Forever, my lady. <laughs> <laughs> the key right there, Tanya. God, <laughs> let us out because she ain't gonna save me for Drop shit. In the gym. Hold on, I'm about to say, nah, she saved me. That's why I'm saying, oh, you forever mine. No, you saved me from that. Yeah, no, nah, you know this maze. And then if she's too expensive for you, you know, yeah. she got on a bunch of Gucci Prada and shit, and nah, you know, see, you working you at know Chick Fil A, yeah. you just know. Hey, you know what? I so can't support your lifestyle. Or no. Say 48, nigga. 48. I just met you. <laughs> what the hell? What you like? Oh, what do you mean? No. We can go to 13 next weekend. No. <laughs> oh, Dude, we can go to the aquarium down the street from State 48. <laughs> okay, yeah, fucking for it. She hit you like, with a whole itinerary immediately. Yeah, no, bro. She know the whole menu and everything. I'm you know? good. Can I stay oh. over here so you can drive and pick me up by 8 o'clock? No. Yeah, usually I like to go here, 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 here. here. No. You we said usually. meeting at this time. These are key there. words here. You yeah. said usually. What? what? <laughs> usually. What do you mean usually? Well, then we can go shop at the gallery. I'm attention to that. That's a red flag. We can go shop at the gallery. Galleria. Flag on the play. Mm-hmm. What we you. shopping for? <laughs> I just what? met you. You buying stuff for yourself? Yeah, I'm like, going to Miami next weekend with uh, such and such. Oh, word. Okay. okay. Right. Maybe. I got a couple questions before we get out of here. <laughs> uh-huh. So you talking to a chick, right? Yeah, you yeah, say yeah. y'all vibing or whatever. Y'all mm-hmm. vibing. Mm-hmm. And um, mm-hmm. y'all decide to make up on link up on a date or okay. whatever. And when you pull up, her car is superior to yours. Okay, okay that's mm-hmm. awesome. I wouldn't. Yeah. That's like, okay. that bad, girl. Oh, that's nice. How you feel? Hey, you trying to race? No, like, I'm hey, with it. No, That's I'm talking cool. about like superior, like you know, like okay. you got a Buick like, like me. Rose as long as some bills ain't behind, like no, nah, cool. like, like Rose, like oh, not Rose, 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 like Rose, like, oh, oh, like, like superior, up there, up like, there. Yeah. like I'm like okay, that's what's up. 
You talking about Maybach? You're not gonna say nothing. Like, oh, what, no, what, it's not gonna, what are you going through mentally? Like, are mentally, you, I'm like, I'm gonna this on myself. Are you phased nice, by it? If we <laughs> had a nice intellectual conversation, and then I, you know, I kind of felt like she was an intelligent woman. Maybe uh, she got the bag and she got her. There we go. Yeah. Me, I don't. It's well, no. Nah, what if she do got a boss? I'm just saying, like, as a guy, what are y'all going through mentally? Do y'all like, damn, that's, that's, that's nice. That shit. makes me want to get your on car. my grind even more. Bro. Now, yeah. stop that's right there. Me. Stop right there. That's a tidbit for women. Because we're going to have to get on them one week. Yeah, 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 yeah. And help sure, them. Sure. And helping, and then yeah, helping, we, man. And not, helping a, not a get on them with a helping manner. Because what women don't realize is they make men want to be better. Yes. And yeah. a lot of times, Submitting to a man, not necessarily meaning getting on your knees, mm -hmm. but literally a lot of times when you submit to a man and make him feel like a man, he wants to cater to you more. Max. Like that's a thing. Like Absolutely. I just so I'll what Ross said example. was key, like, but what Ross said was key. That's gonna make him oh, want to do better because it's not that you're competing, but it's like oh, oh snap, no, but I'm still she's trying to get a ride. Oh yeah, for sure. <laughs> hey yo, the stars, it's the inside move. of this. Oh yeah, oh, we can't go on another oh, day. Do you got the umbrella in the door? I already know about it. But do you, I pull it out? <laughs> yeah, I, feel, I know about it. Yeah. I feel like a little sprinkle out here or something. Yeah. Like that. Let me just pull it out. Yeah. Let me just, <laughs> boom. Yeah. <laughs> But you said you had an example? Yeah. No, nah, like there was a chick that I've been you know, talking to or whatnot, you know, I was cool with her. Uh, we yeah. had a little thing back in like high school and whatnot. Okay. And she told me like, wow, I'm shocked that I thought you would be married with kids right now. And honestly, it kind of blew my mind. I was like, damn, you know what? I guess you're right. Damn. What about that? Obviously, some, you know, I, she kind of made me, I guess, like, realize. realize like, damn, I kind of, I don't want to say wasted time, but I'm like, I guess I could have been, you know, that type of person, like she, she kind of like she saw me Ooh. as somebody higher than what I saw myself. I guess like in value wise. Maybe she applying for an application. So, hell yeah, it could be too. Yeah. So I was like, damn, you know, that's you just. You do have job applications. You open. Yeah. You open. Are you are you hiring right now? Yeah, I'm hiring. Yeah, full time. Okay. But uh, yeah, okay. just resumes are coming in. Yeah, they're definitely coming in. Yeah, a little no slow right now, but no, no, it's, just, it's just steady. Like no that. employees. Slow and yeah. the race. Slow and steady. You don't got no employees in the yeah, yeah, I'm looking for a background experience. So I mean, I got background okay. check. Yeah. Okay. Sometimes too many. You waiting on the background? Not a good thing. So yeah, that's true. Yeah. That's okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Too yeah. many chiefs and not enough Indians. Yeah. Facts. Facts. Mm. Facts. Facts. Mm. So yeah, if you pulling up in the <laughs> rave shit, I'm with it. Yeah, that's, we wait nah, I never. Yeah. Anyway, <laughs> back to what fuck what he was saying. But yeah, about that rave. About the race. So I'm definitely gonna forget my wallet. <laughs> oh, shit. I'm actually, gonna, shit I'm actually gonna put it in the car right yep. now. Oh, for sure. oh, oh, I forgot something Oops. in my car. All right, right, fellas, don't do that. You, you pull up, you Oops. see the whip. Oh, shit, she got me. She got it. She, she oh, yeah, got me I'm today. about to forget my wallet right now. <laughs> she got me today. I'm ordering all the drinks. <laughs> let, me get that lo let me get that lobster. Uh, I don't even like lobster. <laughs> Let me get that lobster mac. I'm allergic to it. I'm allergic to it. I, I work through the pain, baby. That's all right, baby. Oh, yeah. Nothing, oh, nothing, yeah. Nothing, nothing little cortisone ain't going to Nothing a little Shit. allergy medicine. Allegra. Oh, my yep. God. Bro. I'm with that. Hey, yo. But nah, for nah. me personally, it's just a motivational boost. Like, oh, for sure. You know, and it, I'm all for seeing women like that's on her get grind. Get the bag, boy. Yeah. That's, I'm, yes. that's attractive that's... to a lot of older men that's on their stuff. Seeing women like in their bag, they on their grind, they not really depending on nobody, mm, they yeah. making moves for themselves. That's gonna want, especially if you like looking for a partner or whatnot, that's gonna really catch your eye, or it should catch your eye. Like, okay, she in her bag, what am I doing? You know what I'm saying? Because you always gotta ask yourself, would you be someone that you would wanna date? That's the yeah. question you gotta ask yourself. It's true. Are you someone that you would date? And if the answer is no, hell yeah, then you gotta work on some things. If Man, the answer is yes, you know what then I do? Keep expounding on that. I cook, I clean, I don't smell like gasoline. <laughs> there you go. Let me stop. I should have said, and I smell like gasoline because I be pumping my gas. There you go. Oh, yeah. Like, you see that? No, yeah. Ain't no one lit around here, baby. All yes, premium. Sir. That's what you, you gotta did. do. You gotta yeah, do a video. Gas. <laughs> you gotta do a video I with a uh, gas thing, just yeah, spraying that's out really the gas. A new flex. Oh, damn, that is a new flex. Hey, that's the strip club money. That's now hold it up play. to your ear like a damn stack of money with the gas pump. What's right? up, Instead ladies? Of doing this, yeah. be ladies, I got that <laughs> premium. Got yep. that premium gas. Y'all wasting gas because I can. I got, I got it like gas. I can do that. Your nigga can't do Call this. Call me the gas man. <laughs> Bro, the clerk gonna come out and get your ass. Premium P. Hey, cops, get his Sir. ass down. <laughs> hey, hey, buddy, buddy, buddy go get buddy. Him <laughs> that was racist. <laughs> buddy, buddy, buddy. <laughs> not the buddy, Was not. Buddy. I've heard many them clerks, they'll say buddy. Buddy, buddy, buddy. So, buddy. <laughs> nah, you didn't. Nah, we know where what you were going yeah, we know. They good, <laughs> shit. They, yeah, right, bro. Yeah, they, 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 they making bake right now, so they making that money. 
Right. Exactly. Like, buddy, 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 buddy. Stop, stop. But right. hopefully <laughs> this information. Holy moly, donuts. Yeah. All love, man. y'all, man. Yeah. Hopefully for the fellas out there, this was a little bit of some gems that y'all could use. Uh, you know, we we have a. a uh, quite a bit of young uh, subscribers that are yep. in high school or going to college or mm-hmm. in college and may can use this advice. Just don't, just don't be like the Sims out there, man. Be yeah. men, no, be, no. please be men. No man. gasoline on the doors. No, none of that. No, deal no. with rejection. Be a man. man. Work, you know, work on your feelings. It's okay. To get rejected, it's okay to not get the yes. It's okay if someone's making more money. You get on your grind. Simple as that. Yeah, because you're a man, and she yeah. might come back around and be like, "But I like what you got going on." Nah, yeah, we good, we mm-hmm. good. <laughs> Honestly, good. Honestly, never, never mind. mind. Right. Let it go. There we go, man. That's it. You got too sticky. <laughs> So your flight's not. Don't booked. mess with Jimmy. Uh, Cooks. Jimmy Cook. Don't mess with Jimmy Cook. Don't mess because you're a liability. And don't you're be mad. Liability. Don't be mad when I when I block you and your takes start going green. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I take it back. Dre know what the hell he was doing. <laughs> <laughs> it is what it is. For the fellas, we out. Y'all ready? <laughs>